What's up, YouTube? I'm going to show you two ways of how to get tokens in GimKit. Now, the second way is a very, very brand new way. And I'm trying to convince you that that's the way you should be doing it. So don't forget to sub to my new channel, Repool, everybody. Link in the description of all the video, my videos. If you love comic books, different battles and things, I'll link the description of my videos. Don't forget to sub to Repool, everyone. So check it out. The first step is this. Uh, make sure you make your own kit with one answer uh, wrong. Okay, this is very important. If you put all the answers correct and you try to spam this, um, at, the GIM kit will actually not allow you to get XP. Then you want to make sure you set this to 8 to 12 minutes. We're going to get to that in a second. And then 5,000 uh, energy gained per question. You want to open up two tabs. You can see the two tabs here. Now I'm going to show you the first way that everyone's familiar with the how to get tokens. So you can compare it to the brand new way 2023. So the, the the first way is you basically get all these upgrades, right? You you spam these. You get all these upgrades here. You open them there. You go down over here. Let me run over here for a second. You open up these. Okay, pretty much anything that you can interact with. Like you open up this. There's about 20 of them, right? And essentially, you take eight or so minutes to do that, and you'll get your basically weekly XP doing that. So you, you would upgrade all these. You would hit enter, right? I don't have enough energy, but you would enter. And now the problem with that is I actually would enter over here. There's 20 of them around the whole map. Now, the problem with that is you have to basically run around the map and do that actively, and it takes about eight or so minutes, okay? Here's what I would like you to think about. Now that I ran out of energy, here's the new way, everyone. Let me know the comments below. You basically spam this, and look, if I just click it in the swipes, if I just click it in the same spot, yeah, I'm going to get a no every now and then, but now I'm not just moving around. And okay, I got an incorrect one, fine. Okay, that's fine. But I'm not moving around. I'm in one spot, and I can go, you know, do my laundry. I could go do dinner. I could leave the house, essentially. Okay, it'll take a little bit longer, but if you put it, if you get an auto clicker, Okay, like I said, it'll take a little bit longer. If you stick an auto clicker on this, it will take between 8 to 12 minutes for you to get um, the same amount of coins, the same, the same amount of gim bucks, the same amount of XP that you would normally get for um, running around. That's the new way that a lot of people aren't talking about because they want to run around here and open up all these things. It takes, it's a for sure chance. Like, hey, look, I, I did it. Great, but I got to run around and do this and do all that work. Like, what happens if I have stuff to do? What happens if I want to go play, like, Fortnite or something or Roblox or whatever? So I can get an auto clicker and just spam this over and over and over to set it to basically keep clicking in this one spot. Even if, even if it gets it wrong, it's still clicking it. And because I have one no uh, response in here, I'm going to get my, my XP because the um, AI, the gim kit, um, you know, officials aren't going to catch it because they're not all correct because one of them is always wrong. Look at that. I haven't got a wrong one yet. So that's what I suggest that you do. Just get an auto clicker, make a set that only has one wrong, and then now you can go around your business and you don't have to keep on playing this game. Like I said, it's going to take a little bit longer, but you get to move around your house and do whatever. Don't forget to sub. Don't forget to like this video. Peace.